Jerome Harden Studios. This is the latest of my update that I'm willing to tell you about so as you sit back, relax, chillax, and I'll tell you the latest. Hello, my name is Jerome J. Harden, founder and graphic designer of Jerome Harden Studios. How y'all doing? So, um, the topic we're going to talk about today is, um, my personal logo, um, for my graphic design business and for other venues, such as my, um, newscast and all that other stuff, but anyways, um, so, um, as you can see on my, uh, profile page, if you friends with me on Facebook that, you know, I changed my logo to the new one with, you know, the, uh, the update with the scripted writing with the, uh, drip at the end, um, so what I did is, uh, I did a post in, uh, several groups, uh, two versions of my logo between my old logo and the new logo. Now, the, the old logo, which is, uh, I designed it into for the 2017 year, um, that's not my first logo. Like, let me show you my first logo that, uh, I made, uh, when I first started out my business. Now, um, when I first started out my business, I was thinking, like, um, remember I told y'all that, you know, I had, uh, six other jobs before, you know, I decided to, you know, quit looking for a regular job, quit working for a regular job just, you know, to start my own business. Now, if you plan to start your own business, let me tell you this, um, it will not be easy, um, I just found out the hard way. Now, I've been doing graphic design for four years now, and it's going on five now since it's 2020, um, my business will be five years old, but, um, really, Jerome Hart Studios is not five years old, not now, um, Jerome Hart Studios started back in April of 2011, now, um, it's about to, you know, to turn nine years old on April the 9th, 2011, so, um, it's almost, uh, two months away, um, it's about to be March, it's about, um, today is the 24th, um, it's about, you know, after 1 a.m. that I'm recording this, so, um, yeah, so, um, okay, where was I? Okay, back to the topic, um, about my two logos. So, um, what I'm gonna do with my two logos is, you know, like, what you see now when the, when the newscast opened up to the title, um, saying, um, the difference between my two logos, um, the original logo, I never changed colors on, but, um, I had several suggestions when I, uh, posted my, uh, two logos in, uh, different groups, they suggested, you know, just keep the same logo from 2017, just change colors, just make it to a vector file, well, that gave me a suggestion that I might change the colors on, you know, to a vector file, like, say, for orange, yellow, purple, something like that, you know, just put on shirts and stuff, because I found out the hard way, I recently found out that you cannot do shirt designs, you can't put it on decals, you can't put on anything without the gradient. And I see other graphic design uh, posts that some of them are my friends that um, you cannot use gradients for, you know, uh, the logos and stuff, because, you know, It'll mess up, you know, the design, you know, it'll look ugly and something like that. So, yeah, I seen that for myself and, you know, I figured that because, you know, I really had, you know, to change my logo to, you know, to uh, perfect and follow business uh, guidelines. But, um, as I, you know, like I just said, I posted in Facebook groups and one of them suggested, you know, I changed uh, the old logo to a one solid code so it'll stand out. So, I haven't tried out tried it out yet, but I may try it out. So um, I may go back to the Facebook groups, you know, just post my old logo comparison to the new logo I just made. So um, and speaking of which, um, here is the new logo that I've been talking about, um, and here's the other logo from 2017. So um, as you've seen these two different logos right now. I want y'all to be the judge on uh, which logo is the best, you know. Do you like the old logo? Do you like the new logo? I mean, I had mixed reviews about it. And here is the thing. I had one rude person tell me that I need another graphic designer to look at my logo. I was like, really? Are you talking to me like that? I am a graphic designer. And, you know, as, fresh, uh, as uh, professional I can be, you know, sometimes I can tell someone off, I can tell, you know, get off my post, you know, 
And, you know, one, if I always defend myself, I mean, sometimes you have to defend your business. And people will go, LOL, they just laughing at you, you know, they can't get defensive, you know. I mean, that's not the point, guys. I mean, you know, whatever you say, like, I mean, it doesn't matter what you say. I mean, if you're trying to get positive reviews and, you know, I need to change this and that, I mean... I can take that into consideration, but if you're going to be negative about what I create and what I do and all that stuff, I mean, really, I mean, there's nothing you can do about it. I mean, and also, when people give you uh, hate and all that stuff, really, um, if they don't even like your work, I mean, really, there's nothing much you can do, you know, to make them satisfied. I mean, all you can do is just brush it off and move on. I mean, that's all um, I had to learn about, you know. It's about constructive criticism. Um, you just have to, you know, brush it off and move on and just, you know, learn from that. You know, because there's always constructive criticism. People will, won't like, there will be people that won't like your work. There will be people that will, you know, try to give you this extra uh, suggestion. There will be people that will, uh, will be fans of your work. I mean, there are different, all kinds of people that, you know, say this and that and you know and this reminds me um i need to hurry up and do my guidelines right quick because it's getting ridiculous that you know people they ask for all these changes they would do this and that you know that's one thing the first thing they say they like it and another thing they say they don't like it and then you know all of a sudden they want to want to refund and you know i've been getting strict on that about the refunds because you know and I also being very strict about you know doing all these changes because you know I try my best to satisfy the customer they still not satisfied and you know so this is where I draw the line right here and you know just wait till I get my guidelines out I haven't written them out yet to be honest because you know like I said I've been busy with uh all other graphic designs and all that stuff and you know it's just like it's very hard you know trying to manage your business and you know trying you know do videos at the same time but I think I'm doing a good job of doing it because you know I'm trying to you know manage my time and I'm trying to get these designs out from all these people and uh, a message to all you people that has been supporting me but trying to get graphic designers from me like you know I've been late on uh, doing getting projects out on time, but uh, I'm working on trying to get it uh, out to you guys as much as I can. You know, to work is coming in, work's going out, and you know I've been doing the videos at the same time. So it's just me like you know doing time management and jogging between videos, doing graphic design and anything else because you know like I said, 2020 is gonna be a very very busy uh, year for me. So um. And uh, I'm going to be uh, doing a lot of exciting events. Like I said, um, if, uh, you know, I'm going to be doing food reviews. I'm going to be taking road trips, like I said. Um, and uh, I'm going to show you around uh, my apartment. Um, I had it for like three years now. I'm going to show you my artwork. I'm going to show you my new car. I mean, there's lots of things that I want to talk about. Um, so, uh, yeah. And, uh... And the the, um, the logo that I just uh, designed, I mean, it took me two months to recreate that. And to be honest with you haters, um, I am probably not going to change that at all. So, again, if you don't like my page, if you don't like why I recreated it, I mean, if you're going to talk so much crap about me, about how horrible I am, about negative reviews, blah, blah, blah. I mean, all that negativity is not going to change me. All that negativity is going to make me stronger, and for those that have been giving me positive vibes, giving me suggestions, I would like to thank you for, you know, following me on this journey for like four years now, and I'm going to continue on this journey. Ain't nobody going to stop me. Ain't nobody going to change who I am. I'm Jerome J. Harden, founder and graphic designer of Jerome Harden Studios. I created these two logos, and on the suggestion that I have gotten from one of these people once again I'm going to try to test it out one more time and you know I'm going to put it back on the in the Facebook groups and I'm going to let the people judge so and uh, and uh, another thing too what I learned while I was doing graphic design I mean 
Well, first, sorry, graphic design. I mean, do you know that um, I was, you know, money, uh, think about money while I'm doing graphic design because, you know, the other people were right. You got to get paid for your work. But um, sometimes, like, I learned that, you know, out of the goodness of my heart, like, uh, I love doing designs. It's not just about the money. It's about, you know, passion, you know, my creativity. Um, just like I'm doing videos right now. Um, like I said, the reason I haven't done videos is because I haven't had the passion and creativity. It's just, you know, all about money. But I'm not about money anymore. It's about creativity and passion. Just like I'm doing videos now, I'm doing it out of passion and creativity. I want to give my message out to people that, you know, I am back and I'm going to be uh, very firm on my business. I'm going to, you know, reach my goals. Ain't nothing going to stop me. Ain't nothing going to get me down, which, you know, I had, you know, I had a great sales on, you know, in the Christmas season. But, you know, it's just like, you know, people want to rush and stuff. And I don't really like that when I get Okay, sorry guys, um, the flash went on because the battery's about to die, but um, I got like 50% left, so um, I got a few minutes before I close out this video. But anyways, um, so like I said, I don't like to be rushed, you know, I don't like to be feel like I'm a fast food restaurant because I recently told a customer that, you know, I'm staying my ground this time. I can't, you know, let these people run my business. I run my business. Nobody's the boss of me. The reason, this is the reason I left uh, my old job in the first place. So I can start my own business. I can have the freedom that I want. I can work from home. I can work anywhere. You know. And another thing too um, that I'm going to talk about. I'm going to show you the workplaces that I've been working at. Um, if you haven't seen Dead Landing. Like if you've never been to Huntsville, Alabama. I will sh also show you around. So like I said, 2020 is going to be a good year for me. And I hope you're going to enjoy season nine so um yeah and uh, so um about these two logos before i close out these videos just so um uh, i'm going to test it out going to get the audience to opinions before i choose the final logo and uh just remember that um the titles that you see the logos that you see and the beginning titles that um these are, you know, just to be tested out. I may, um, may put the new one on the titles, you know, and just use the old logo for other stuff, such as decals and all that stuff. Or the new logo may be permanent for the business. So, I don't know. I mean, hopefully it is, but I don't know. It may be my old logo. So, we'll see what happens and, you know, take it from there. So, um, I really hope you enjoyed this newscast. Um... And uh, the next one is going to be, you know, and uh, the screen, I'm going, I got to show you the screenshot, guys, because I am not kidding. I give, I bet, I've been getting uh, mixed reviews about it, and take a look. And they, people, there's a lot of people saying they love it, and there's people saying they hate it, but hey, the hate's not going to change my mind, guys, so um, you can forget it, okay? <laughs> so you can forget it, so, um, yeah, so... Um, yeah, so I'll show you, I'll show you the screenshots, you know, I mean, this, this is, this is really crazy, guys, and, uh, if you're friends on me on Facebook, you know, you can always see the screenshots anytime on my, uh, page, so, um, yeah, so, anyway, guys, um, I think that's all I'm going to talk about, but, you know, I've been getting better at the newscast, uh, better than season eight, because, you know, I've been talking really slow, I've been really sluggish, but, you know, practice makes perfect, right? <laughs> yeah, but, you know, sorry for, you know, for slurring, for starting for, you know, speak, skipping, speaking words, and all that stuff, but, you know, I'm getting better at it, but, anyways, um, uh, I'm going to be signing off this video, but, um, until next time, I'm Jerome J. Harden, founder of, founder of graphic designer of Jerome Martin Studios, I am out, peace.